Rui Lopez opening, Morphe defense, Smith's love brayers Itsev hybrid system. Intense that was a serious game. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was a well-fought middle game that White got the better of. Although White played a great end game, Black did even better. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. A typical answer is e5, which builds a position in the middle, controls d4, and frees up the queen and bishop on the dark square. The move nf3 advances the knight toward the center, engages the e5 piece in combat, and sets up a castle. nc6 defends the pawn on e5, advances the knight toward the center, and scans the d4 square. The Rui Lopez opening develops the bishop to immediately attack the knight on c6, the lone defender of the e5 pawn. A6 forces the bishop to decide, exchange or retreat. BA4 safely retreats the bishop while keeping pressure on the knight. NF6 attacks the undefended e4 pawn and develops the knight at the same time. Castling gets the king out of the center and prepares to develop the rook to e1. b7 develops the dark squared bishop and prepares to castle. 1 rupee centralizes the rook and protects the e4 pawn. b5 gains space on the queen side and forces the bishop to the b3 square. bb3 is forced, but the bishop is well placed because it attacks the f7 square. d6 defends the e5 pawn and allows the light squared bishop to develop. C3 prepares the d2-d4 pawn break and clears the c2 square for the light squared bishop. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. H3 prevents black from developing the light squared bishop to g4, which would pin the knight and make it hard for white to play d4. Re8 centralizes the rook and opens up the f8 square. d4 attacks the e5 pawn, opens the diagonal for the dark squared bishop, and gains space in the center. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. Games Master It is the final book action. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This shifts the bishop to a square with more activity, giving it greater scope. That's good. This ignores an opportunity to strike at the center with a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. That is a logical response. It is quite good. That's fine. It is good. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is quite good. The rooks are linked by this making it easier for them to work together in the future. That's good. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. That's good. A rook enters the action after developing outside of its starting square as a result. It is quite good. This develops the bishop and gives it scope on the long diagonal. It is good. This exchange is fair. It is quite good. Recaptures. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is quite good. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This is an equal trade. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is ideal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is ideal. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. This threatens to create an x-ray attack through two pieces. It is best. As a result, the adversary is unable to launch an x-ray strike through two components. It is ideal. When a rook retreats, this attack wins a tempo. That's good. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. As a result, 
the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. That's good. This threatens to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is a miss. That's a decent move. That's good. This misses the chance to offer an equitable exchange of pieces. It is incorrect. Very precise. It is best. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This enables the adversary to make a passed pawn. It is incorrect. Backs off. It is ideal. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is quite good. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. This prevents the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This is a missed chance to offer an equal exchange of goods. It is incorrect. Recaptures. It is ideal. This pushes a passed pawn. It is best. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This moves the queen to safety. It is best. It is a fair deal after all captures. That's good. Backs off. It is ideal. A pawn kicks the opposing queen, forcing her to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. This poses a queen winning danger. It is ideal. The moved pawn advances toward its objective. That's good. This defends the attacked knight. It is good. This misses a better way to move a rook to safety. This permits the opponent to fork pieces. It is an inaccuracy. This forks pieces by creating a simultaneous attack. This is the only good move. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is a great move. This is an equal trade. It is best. This is the only move that works. It is best. By posing a threat to a queen and compelling it to flee, this wins a tempo. That is good. This moves the queen to safety. It is best. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This protects the attacked pawn. This is the only good move. It is a great move. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is incorrect. This pushes a passed pawn. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is ideal. This misses the chance to move a queen to safety. It is incorrect. This misses a much better move. It is a mistake. That was a great move and very hard to find. It is brilliant. A solid choice. It is excellent. The pawn reaches the back rank and promotes to a queen. It is best. Very precise. It is best. Recaptures. White is ahead at this point in the endgame. It is ideal. This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is excellent. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was a well-fought middle game that White got the better of. Although White played a great end game, Black did even better.